A client organizer is a helpful part of the tax preparation process since it provides the taxpayer guidance in preparing for their tax appointment. In Drake Tax, we provide several organizer types, so you choose the format that best suits your client. When generating organizers, choose to include some or all of various organizer page types, including cover sheets and letters, the organizer checklist, interview sheets, and form pages. In Drake Tax 2017, you can customize the organizer even further by adding or removing items on the organizer checklist or by creating your own custom questionnaire page from scratch. Let's look at the checklist on a completed organizer. The checklist condenses the organizer down to one page and includes information from the prior year return along with other items that are included on every checklist. This page can be customized. You can add or take away checklist items, rearrange the order in which items display, or add additional text to the page. The miscellaneous information pages act as interview sheets asking the taxpayer questions like, did you make a major purchase this year? Did you work out of town any time during the year? Or did you have any gambling losses? There are two pages of questions broken down into categories. You can now create your own custom page similar to a miscellaneous page called the questionnaire page. Choose to include the custom page in addition to the miscellaneous pages or include the custom questionnaire page instead of these miscellaneous pages. To customize organizer pages, create organizers in Drake Tax. From the menu bar of the home window, click the last year's data menu and select organizers. Choose between the summary and the comprehensive and then click next. From here, leave the field blank to run a batch or add specific clients and press enter. At the bottom of the Organizer Options dialog box, choose the new Custom Editor option. The Custom Editor opens with the checklist selected for editing. Click the arrow beside the Open icon to choose to edit the questionnaire. The Custom Editor consists of a toolbar and several panes beneath. The largest pane lists the items that appear in the selected document. At this moment, we're looking at the Organizer Checklist so we see every possible item that could generate on the checklist based on the client's prior year return. The items are displayed in a forms tree. Click the arrow to the left of the item to display a list of forms and other items nested underneath. When you make a selection from the pane on the left, a brief description of the type of item you selected and instructions on how to customize that item appear in the How to Use pane. Note that the item selected on the left side appears in a blue field in the Selected Item Details pane on the right. So for example, if I want to edit the instruction text, I would select the text, and it appears in the Selected Item Details section. Here I edit the text. Next, click Save or press Tab. Once you've saved an item, click Preview to see how it looks in a sample generated organizer. To delete an item from the checklist, select the item and drag it to the trash can. Standard items are items that Drake includes on the checklist, and custom items are used to add your own items to the organizer page. For example, to add a custom item to the other income section of the checklist, choose the type of custom item for the list. For example, a custom checkbox item, because we want the custom entry to display with a checkbox. Click and drag it to other income and place it just below cancellation of debt. Once it's added, I can enter the text I want to display over in the blue pane and click save. Again, click preview to see how your new checklist looks and click save. If you've made changes and you decide you want to go back to the original checklist that was shipped with Drake Tax, click restore. Now you've seen how you can edit the checklist page of the organizer. Let's look at adding a completely customized page to the organizer, the new questionnaire page. Switch your view by going to Open Questionnaire. Some items are listed to get you started, but you may remove them to start with a blank slate if desired. Again, the Available Items section allows you to create yes or no questions, checkboxes, double checkboxes, or fill in the blank questions. Since these are yes or no questions, I will add a double checkbox item and custom text. When you're finished with your customization, click Save and Exit. 
To add the new custom pages to your organizer, select them from Form Options, located on the Organizer Options screen, next to the Custom Editor button. Choose Form Options to open the Form Properties Editor. Available organizer pages are listed and display the form name, form description, and a checkbox to either include or exclude this page from the organizer. Click to include your custom questionnaire page as part of the organizer. The checklist is included by default and can also be enabled or disabled as needed. To change the form order from this screen, simply drag and drop. Form options are global changes that will affect all organizers that you print until you change them again. When you're done selecting your options, continue with the printing process. The last step when generating organizers is to choose your organizer print and delivery options. Just like the other pages of the organizer, the new custom pages may also print it as fillable PDFs. For more information, visit drakesoftware.com.